So things are looking real bad for Kaladin, and he's getting more and more depressed, and he decides that's enough. He's going to go kill himself. So he goes out. Uh, it's during a high storm, towards the end of a high storm, where it's just raining hard. He goes outside, and he goes to this chasm nearby, and he's going to jump and kill himself. But Syl, the Spren, she comes and uh, appears to him and kind of talks him out of it. And there's some really interesting things here about Syl. She tells him that she remembers when he was in the army, and she would watch him, and she was inspired by him, and like that's why she was attracted to him, because he would try to save his men and do all he could to protect his men, which is really interesting, because a spren should not remember things like that, should not understand things like that. It, we're learning things about Syl. It's very interesting. She knows things that spren shouldn't know. Um, and then so he goes back to the camp. He confronts Gaz, this antagonist guy, and he just tells him, hey, I'm the bridge leader now. You're going to stay out of my way. And uh, he decides to try to save his men and protect them one more time to keep trying. That is the end of part one of The Way of Kings. Next up, the interludes.